much. Operation Safe Return is a go. Please welcome Melissa Castro with the Auto Theft Task Force. We also have Officer Aaron Stewart joining us with How to Get Involved. Guys, it's great having you, and thanks for being in so early. Thanks for having us. Yeah, we appreciate <laughs> it. Um, okay, Officer um, Stewart. I was just talking to you uh, a second ago. You get to go into to schools and visit with kids, um, kind of building that connection, that bridge with them. How does this event, Operation Safe Return, kind of coincide with that and get them ready for school? Right, well, when we go into the schools, we get to have a relationship with the kids, uh, let them know that they can talk to us if they need to. And when this Operation Safe Ret event return, uh, we give back to the community that way too, through school supplies, making contacts with kids, the parents, uh, getting them involved with our community resources that we have there as well. I know y'all are looking for sponsors. That's always a big part of this. Like, cause, I mean, you can't do this without uh, community sponsors. Right. Uh, what are some of the things that you're looking for from a sponsor? How can somebody contribute that wants to? Well, uh, we have our crime prevention officer up there that has a list of everything we need. Uh, if they want to call our police department at 886-2600 mm -hmm. and ask for our crime prevention officer, uh, they can give them a list of everything we need. Um, we're still looking for monetary donations, uh, school supplies, anything that we could use to give back to the community, we'll, we'll use it. I know uh, several thousand kids came last year along with their families. And uh, Melissa, this is a chance also, you got the Jeep out there. I see it around town all the time, talking right. about all the stuff. How does, what is your role in this, and especially with the kids and the families? Well, right now with the summer months, you know, we've got a lot of these large events that are taking place. So that's uh, one of the kind of targets, I guess, for the uh, auto thieves and people that are breaking into vehicles. So July has been declared as a watcher car month throughout Texas because it's such a problem with us, um, the auto crimes. So I'm just here to remind everyone to make sure and lock your vehicle and no weapons inside, no personal information. Um, don't leave anything inside, especially when you're going to an event like this that they'll know you're going to be in there a couple of hours. So that'll give them a window of opportunity. So just making sure just that everyone locks their car and um, we're gonna have a proclamation as well mm -hmm. during city council on the 23rd of this month so, um, like I said, it's uh, losses for auto crimes are over a billion dollars throughout Texas. Okay. So. Uh, we're going to put some information on the screen right now. It is on the 27th, so if you don't have any plans, we want you to go in and stop by. And if you do, make time to come by. Um, guys, thank you so much for coming in. It's always a pleasure thank visiting you. with you all and the service that you provide, especially keeping us safe, and Melissa, you as well. Thank, thank you, you thank so you. much. Okay.